guys, Mommy Jedi here. Just wanted to say hello to all 666 of you subscribers. Wait, 666? 666? Woo! Can one of you please ask your friends to subscribe so we can get past that ugly number of 666? Anyways, the reason for this video today is I wanted to address some concerns that have been brought up on all of our Swap Me Lego minifigure haul videos. We made three of them. The first one we made was probably a year ago, and then the last one we made was over six months ago. So it's been quite some time. But our channel has grown so much over the past couple of months that people are now just viewing them. So what we have discovered is is people are very upset that we got scammed. We purchased fake Lego brick minifigures. I didn't even know there was such thing as fake mini brick figures. I really didn't know. I'm just a mom. I just thought I was buying my son something that he really enjoyed to play with. So now that everybody has let us know that they, we got scammed, we get it, we understand, we did get scammed. And you know, someone did mention it to us, um, probably eight months ago was the first time someone said, those are fake knockoff Lego minifigures. And I saw the comment and I said, maybe they are, maybe they aren't, not a big deal to me. So we went back again to buy more Lego minifigures and again so yes we went three times and yes we got scammed every single time i just didn't know how to tell the difference between fake or real i definitely know now because i googled it and i've done my research i know how to take the head off and check the little prong right there to make sure it says l-e-g-o lego we want lego real lego and you can even remove the body and read right in between the little legs, L-E-G-O, Lego. So I have gone back and checked the minifigures that we purchased, and thank goodness, not all of them were fake. We did, the majority of them did purchase, they were fake. But there was probably like three out of all of them, which we purchased less than 20, we didn't spend more than 40 bucks, out of all those, about three of them were real, but the rest were fake. So we got scammed. I even let Geo the Jedi know that we got scammed. I thought that I would be able to tell a fake from a real, but I couldn't. I really wasn't a professional at it. I'm so sorry that you guys are all so upset that we bought fake Lego minifigures. Now I want to address some of your concerns about us purchasing the fake brick minifigures. A lot of you have told us that their poison in the paint of the fake minifigures. Well, I want to let you know that we are all healthy and safe. Nothing has harmed us in the, in, um, the process of playing with the fake minifigure bricks. We're safe and sound. I've checked on it. We definitely can't be harmed from the fake bricks minifigures. Now, would we ever purchase them again? No, we would never purchase them again. Now, I also wanted to clear up the fact that a lot of you thought I was just trying to scam my own son by purchasing him fake ones without him knowing. That just wasn't the case. And when I did let Geo the Jedi know that some of those figures we purchased were fake, he didn't care, which I'm pretty proud of him for. Who needs big name brands when you're playing with toys? To a five-year-old, it's just a toy to play with. You know, he's only five at the time that we made those videos and he just didn't care that they were fake. So I hope that clears that portion up. And what else I wanted to talk about was, why are you all so mad at us? The hate and bullying we're getting over the past two months daily, we are being told every day to go kill ourselves um, I hope that you guys get deported from Trump, you Mexicans and your fake Lego minifigures. We have been asked to meet people at places to fight my son. 
we have been told that we're retarded, my son is retarded, that I'm fat and I'm ugly. These are all just young-minded kids probably writing these horrible, mean statements to us on our channel. And we do understand that hate comes and love comes. When you put yourself out there on a channel like YouTube, you're out there for everyone to view you. So we're not mad. We're not complaining. We love all the attention that our channel is receiving over the past couple of months. We appreciate all of you watching. We just wish some of the hate and bullying would stop. And I'm hoping that with me letting you know about those three Swap Meet Lego video hauls, that that'll clear up some of the confusion behind why we went back three times. I'm really sorry that it upset you all. And I hope that you all have a fabulous day. And I hope that you all will continue to watch our channel grow, watch our videos, hit that thumbs up button, and leave us some kind comments. Because guess what? Being kind is a lot easier than being hateful and mean. And that's what we practice in our household. And that's what we teach Geo the Jedi that we should always be kind to one another. And I'm going to leave on that note and just say thank you. Thank you, everybody. We love you all, and we hope you have a fabulous day. Mwah.